Okay, Spring Lafay, Simply Tarot. Okay, Leo, this is going to be a reading for you. So we're just going to see what we get. All my readings are timeless. I have pre-shuffled. So I'm pretty much going to get on into the reading. On um, three. One more. Queen of Discs, Queen of Pentacles. Lovers. The Devil. Queen of Swords. Okay, what I'm getting from this is that I'm getting that you're taking on this queen of discs and, you know, you're doing your thing, you're working very hard um, to do whatever it is that you're doing in your life, whatever that may be. You know, we've got lovers here because I feel like you're dealing with someone um, or you're going to be. For some of you, this is already a relationship. For some of you, this is something you need to watch out for. Um, the devil card is here. And I feel like that it is here because, honestly, there's something that needs to go. There's something within a connection that needs to go. There's some kind of toxicity. Now, you could be dealing with a Capricorn, but I feel like there's something that's toxic that needs to go out of this connection. We've got the Queen of Swords here. I need to figure out if that is a person or if that is you. Okay, is the Queen of Swords Leo? Okay, the Queen of Swords is you. This is you as well. So, you see the sun. That's for Leo. That's Leo card. What you're telling me is that you're taking on the Queen of Discs and the Queen of Swords. You're working very hard on your stability. But also, at the same time, you're tired of taking any crap. You're done with taking any crap from a lover. Or from, I'm going to be honest with you, this feels like family or friends or anyone. Someone new, you're done. You're not going to take any crap from anyone anymore. You're done with it. It's like you're taking control back. Um, you, you're cutting away what is toxic. You're wanting to cut that out of your life. You know, and that could be a bad behavior of sorts. Now, you have to remember if you need to switch yourself, switch yourself. Because you could be, you know, I could be talking to a cross watcher. I mean, and you may be the one that, you know, is the other person. Okay, what we've got here is we've got someone who's working very hard, it feels like, with Prudence being here. Um, which is, you know, the, the Eight of um, Pentacles. And then we've got Art here. So what that tells me is that um, it's almost like someone is working at their art. They're trying to create something. It's like they're trying to create something using their art. Now, when I say you using their art, that could be just the art of their nature. Uh, the way that they do something, you know, the way that they put their spin on something. It doesn't have to be actual, like, artwork. We've got cruelty here because I feel like that you've been hurt and you're done with it. Someone's hurting you. Um, and, it, you know, it, it's gone past the point of being in your head with it. That's Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords is about being in your head. This is about pain. It's gone past the being in your head. You see those drops of blood? Someone, this is actually hurting you. Hangman, making a decision. Princes of Swords. See, that's cutting away. That's cutting away what no longer serves you. So, I feel like you're making a decision to break free from whatever this toxic relationship is. The universe, yeah. You're ending a cycle. 
it's time to begin a new cycle and break free from whatever is um, toxic in your life, holding you back, um, whatever is to the point where you're not benefiting from it. It's time to free yourself from that. That's what I'm getting. So, And I feel like that's what you're doing. I feel like that you are freeing yourself from whatever is not serving you. You're going to take your life back. And it feels like it's got to do with the relationship. I'm going to be honest with you. This is a relationship. Um, now, it could be, it doesn't have to be, um, like I said, it could be a lover. It could be a friend. It could be family. It could be work related. But something is ending because somebody hurt somebody. And it's like you, you're taking this moment to really look at things and figure it out because it's, it's got you in pain. Now, I want you to look. This has got nails through the hands. See, it's like pain. It's painful. It's painful to look at. It's painful. It hurts. That's what I'm getting from that. So, yeah. That's what I've got for you. Um, in the extended, I'm going to ask a little further on you. And I'm going to ask a little bit further on that person that you're dealing with. Whoever that is. Uh, because they really didn't show us exactly who the person is. Uh, I think I'm going to ask with these cards. But they did show me that you're taking on um, the Queen of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords. So, yeah, that link for the extended will be below. And uh, if you like the content that I create, do give it a thumbs up. Please do subscribe. And... Um, Something about goats or um, mountain goats or such. I'm not sure why, but I'm drawn to it. Yeah, I am. Much light and love to you. That link will be below for the extended.